Chris, have you ever uh, felt explosive? Like uh, you're having a little argument with your wife, or girlfriend, boyfriend, and uh, suddenly you feel the explosion coming in and you feel like you're losing control. You feel like you need to, you know, just break down the walls. And there's that animal instinct is, is kind of brewing up in your body and about to boil over. Very common. And uh, uh, we all have probably experienced that at some point or another. Uh, what this really is happening is <clears throat> there are deeper structures in the brain. For example, there is area called the amygdala, there's an area called the cingulate gyrus that are receiving actual chemical um, uh, input from the bloodstream. And also, they're interacting with the areas that control emotions, including uh, right next to it, the temporal lobe. But uh, what allows you to control that explosiveness is actually here in the prefrontal cortex. These areas play a role in what, what psychologists like to call executive function, meaning they instantly are, are supposed to get working in controlling that explosion. And it's right here. It's right here in usually the dorsal lateral, the upper part of your prefrontal cortex. So what if you have a concussion? What if you've had injury to this region because you just hit your head and against a very hard surface? Well, guess what? That area that controls emotions has been injured through mechanical forces applied to it. And that is why many patients, many people who've actually suffered concussions cannot experience cannot control their explosive behavior. And uh, many of you have seen the movies or heard about uh, CTE, chronic traumatic encephalopathy, which is a result of multiple concussions. A lot of that is because this area that normally controls and allows you to control the explosiveness has been injured. But uh, a lot of us have not had concussions, but they're, we're not able to control those explosive behaviors. So how can you how can you treat that? How can you modify that? Well, you can go through therapy to try to empower that region to control that uh, animalistic uh, explosive behavior. Or if that doesn't work, what we do here is we stimulate that region to make it more powerful. So everyone has experienced this. Everyone has at some point in their life become explosive. But if it's repetitive, if it's disturbing your relationships, if it's disturbing your life, if you just did something that cost you, you know, your job or your relationship, that's when you really need to pay attention to it and get it managed and, and treated. So um, don't have explosions. And if you do, uh, make sure that you understand that there are ways that you can manage them.